Your Royal Highnesses, Your Excellencies, the Bikuben Foundation, ladies and gentlemen, good day, mates. <laughs> Back in the 80s, a TV critic wrote the rather pessimistic sentence, life is too short for a Danish TV drama. We're very happy that the combined efforts of a lot of creative people managed to prove that wrong over the course of the following 30 years. Our two series, Forbrydelsen and Borgen, are the results of a deliberate investment of time and great efforts creating TV drama by Danish broadcasting for many years, all the time insisting on developing our own methods and ways of telling stories. For many years, it would have been unthinkable that a Danish series would stand a chance outside Scandinavia. So you can probably imagine our gratitude and quite astonished pride when we now see the killing and born are being shown in many countries all over, also in America and the UK, in Danish. And we are tremendously happy and proud that our Australian friends also like both shows. We have really, yes. <laughs> As I was about to say, we have uh, really experienced such warm and friendly welcome over here, um, down here, and, um, and so much genuine interest for the two series, and we want to thank the um, Australian audience deeply for that. Thank you. <clears throat> we believe that the exchanging of stories across borders holds not only great beauty, but also great importance. It broadens our horizon and makes us wiser on other cultures, as well as our own. For us to be able to share our stories with the rest of the world and see them so well received has been such an immense joy. With us tonight on stage should be the creator of The Killing, my old friend and colleague, Mr. Søren Sveistrup, but he was unfortunately unable to come. But both The Killing and Born represent years of teamwork by a lot of very talented and dedicated people. The producers, the directors, the set designers, the photographers, the staff writers, and the many great actors of both Born and The Killing. Over 300 million, no. I'm just joking. Over 300 people have actually participated in creating each of our two series. I had to say it, I'm sorry. Um, so this is indeed an award that goes out to the combined efforts of all. Perhaps there's a little specifically Danish DNA in both series that somehow strikes a chord in other people than the Danish. Shakespeare once wrote, there's something rotten in the state of Denmark. Now we can say there's something written in the state of Denmark. <laughs> That's actually finding an audience outside Denmark these years. If someone had told us 10 years ago that we would be standing on the stage of the iconic and magnificent Sydney Opera House, accepting the Crown Prince Couples Cultural Award for our two series, we would have said... <laughs> With doubt. It only proves the old fact, reality always beats fiction. Your... <laughs> Your Royal Highnesses, deres kongelige højheder. Excellencies, the Bikuben Foundation, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of all the creative people that have participated in the making of the killing and born, we are deeply grateful for this award and the acknowledgement of our work. Thank you, or as we say in Denmark, mange, mange, mange tak. tak. <laughs>